Hello everyone, Eduardo Gulpan here. In today's video guys, I'm going to show you on how to remove the default message box in the combo box error. Especially if you want to hide the MS Access branding. Sample guys, this one. Let's go to the products and then uh, product entry. So sample, this one. Okay, we, we got this error, Microsoft Access. Because we have entered a value which is not in the list. So to remove this kind of message, and change our and replace our customized message box so let us close this then let's go to the form this one so sample okay let's go to the data and then make sure guys limit to list is set to yes and then allow value list edits no and then let's go to the event function then let's find the on not in list then click this three dots and hit the code builder and OK. So, let's type this message box. Message box, for example, the item you have entered is not in the list. Um, please select a valid option. Then, uh, the type of uh, message box, I like BB critical and then the title of the message box is invalid option something like this so let's try again let's type okay the item you have entered is not in the list please select a valid option and then when we click okay still we got this Microsoft Access so let's continue guys so let's put the value of this response so let's type response equals ec data error continue okay let's try the item you have entered and then okay okay so we successfully removed those default message box and then we can continue guys. I will add the name of the sticks box is I mean um, combo box is U O M stands for unit of measure. Me that U O M equals a null. So it will erase. Okay. And then again. So the message box is too long so I will put the second sentence in the second line okay the item okay this one I will put something like this and bb crlf and okay so let's try again the item you have entered is not in the list. Please select a valid option. Okay. So, that's it guys. If you think this video helps you, please do me a favor by giving me a thumbs up. That's all. Thank you and see you to my next video.